West Hall mean friend and welcome to another video. This is European Laws Influenza Pigs of 2023. Oh yes, the same day, the very same day, the Oscars were distributed. I am going to provide you with my list of top three YouTubers to follow because uh, I have had this particular channel for quite some time and even before that I had had another channel called Psycho Seb which I am going to revive and used solely and only and exclusively for reviewing good comic books and good books in general literature so there is something you can look forward to however I couldn't have escaped interacting and, uh, well, really hearing and watching and looking at uh, other YouTubers, my fellow influencers. No, I don't consider myself to be an influencer. I'm just a fellow, uh, I mean, <laughs> a humble European fella who has got a YouTube channel. Uh, well, then, and uh, many of you have been telling me in comments here and there, oh, check out this video, check out that video, this YouTuber covered it as well, and so on and so forth. And I'm like, in, yeah, I mean, yeah, why? M most influencers that I have been recommended uh, are just covering the current thing. They are the so-called grifters, who are just moving from one topic to another to get them clicks. Now, I don't want to say that I didn't do any videos for clicks. That would be hypocritical. I did. But I always um, stick to my thing, and uh, I've got very strong principles. And I never talk about anything that I don't care about. Also, I, if, if I have something to say, and no! that the video in question will have just three views, I will do the video nevertheless, because I do it for you and for myself. It is quite entertaining for me. And also, I refuse to uh, support YouTubers who claim to be a, a huge fan of something. But they are really not. You ask them a simple trivia question and they know nothing. And then in a month, they are a huge fan of something else. There is uh, one YouTuber, I am not going to name anybody, uh, who was, uh, around the time when the Rings of Power came out, a huge Tolkien fan, a tremendous one. So I watched uh, a, a short uh, snippet of a live stream with him, and uh, he was asked a question, and then he was asked another question, and then I asked him a question, and he was not able to answer even one of them, a single one of them correctly. And not only correctly, he couldn't answer at all. He was just stu stuttering and then he evaded answering. All right then, so recently I checked out his channel and that's that very same kind of YouTuber that I absolutely abhor. Uh, the one who is a huge fan of divers and different things each and every uh, month when something new comes out. Now, Re quite recently, and as of making of this video, it's been the TMNT because they have swapped uh, April O'Neil. Now, should you wish to know if I am a huge TMNT fan, I have only made a couple of videos about TMNT because that's not the primary topic of my channel. But I ha have been a lifelong TMNT fan, and I know, and it's my favorite, the original Mirage comic books from the 1980s. And I have even made a review of one of the latest TMNT comic books, which is actually good, The Last Ronin. Feel free to check out my videos on YouTube. So, but those kind of videos will be on my uh, secondary channel, Psycho Seb, in the near future should you wish to subscribe to that. Now, this being said, there are also YouTubers who I respect, but who don't need my help. They are much bigger YouTubers than I am, and they are doing quite all right without me. For example, Nedrotic. Does this guy, an awesome fella, one of the good guys. I like Gary, he's great. And he has uh, given me many shout-outs uh, throughout his live streams. But does he really need my shout-outs? He's got, like, what, half a million subscribers, maybe more. So uh, I'm going to uh, point out three YouTubers that I want to point out for different reasons. So the first is um, cartoonist Kayfay. Well, they've got around 70,000 subscribers, so they are much bigger than I am, but... Um, I want to recommend them for one single 
reason. They are genuinely in love with what they are doing. And they are doing it just because they love it. Now, both of them, both of the hosts, Ed Piscor and Jim Rugg, uh, are uh, comic book creators. They have published many comic books, uh, both at Marvel and by themselves, uh, and at Image Comics and in d- different places. And they know their comic book history. And they know their comic book craft. And they know... I mean, man, everything about comic books that you can possibly imagine. And mostly they do videos of the kind they take a comic book or uh, an issue of the Wizard magazine and they go from cover to cover and they do um, commentary on it. And like very detailed commentary from the point of view of the pros, of the professionals. And... What's more, they are even very often uh, recording um, interviews with uh, really stars of the comic book medium industry, like uh, Frank Miller, Kevin Eastman, uh, Peter Ladd, uh, and even from the uh, animation industry, like Ralph Bakshi. They've got a fantastic interview with Ralph Bakshi. Should you be interested in that? So Cartoonist Kayfabe, 100% recommend them. Go if you like comic books. They are the channel to go. The second channel is also very big, but uh, I recommend him for, uh, once again, one single simple reason. He is the closest to me as far as the the types of videos he makes. Um, Because he, well, his name... It, the channel's name is uh, Comics Matter with your boy Zach. And it's host, well, it's Zach, but it's a persona. His real name, which is uh, uh, quite, uh, well, it's not a secret. Uh, it's very public. Uh, Richard C. Meyer. He's also a comic book creator and a former veteran uh, from the American Army or Marines, was it? I don't remember now. And uh, he publishes his own comic books on Indiegogo as well. But uh, he criticizes uh, comic books. Well, he used to criticize comic books. He doesn't do that that often these days, but he criticizes the American comic books industry. And he started, he was one of the first people who rose up and started to criticize the American comic book industry when it started to go to hell. And many people followed him. And many people followed his example. And if it wasn't for your boy Zach, there would be... a. I, I I dare say, 1% of uh, the crowd of people who are against the atrocities that are being uh, done to the American comics. So uh, 100%, I do recommend um, your boy Zach. And uh, he's closest to me in that um, in his style of videos. He's just ranting. He's just talking. He doesn't edit too much. He just speaks to his audience as if they were friends. So there you go. And the third one is uh, uh, Just Some Guy. Now, Just Some Guy, uh, he doesn't put out many videos, which is uh, also very nice because, I mean, if there is a YouTuber who puts out like three or five videos every day only to cover the current thing and uh, to get the clicks, for example, YouTubers who around the Johnny Depp and the Heard spectacle put out five videos a day, a day on that same subject, you you know why they did that. And they will never ever whatsoever mention it again. But Just Some Guy doesn't do that. Uh, sometimes he covers the current thing, but he always has something relevant to say. And he makes very good points about the matter at hand. And uh, for one reason or another, mainly for social political uh, political reason, it, it, a few what what was it months ago, a year ago, uh, some people went against him. Uh, but I mean, come on, should we really care about people's social or political reasons if they are talking about uh, entertainment and have ge- very good points? Now, come on. All right then. So these are the three channels that uh, Euro- European law recommends that I do recommend. It's Cartoonist, Kayfabe, it's Comics Matter with your boy Zach and just some guy. All right then. So let me know in the comments down below what you think about my picks and if you like those YouTubers or not, if you have known about them before or not. And that will be all. Thank you very much for watching and Namarie.